We're early again. The tide is high. But three hours it'll be lower. Stand by. So far no stinging nettles. I've dug two targets, a 12-17 and a 12-11. 17 was a piece of aluminum wire. The 17 was a little piece of copper wire. Mmm. Stand by. Third target, a little pendant. 925 it says. And this is going to be a good day. I don't see it in this scoop. There's something in this pile of rocks, I hope, or either I missed it. But you can see right there, I got a marble. You don't find many marbles at this beach. But when you do, that's a good taquito. Yes, sir, Ray Bob. Let's see what else is in it. It's a strong 42, 47 signal, a silver signal. But I don't see nothing in there but rocks. Maybe it's still in the hole. But it was a nice sound. Let me tell you that. I don't see any silver looking things in there. Unless, unless, that could be the stick, the strumpet right there. Let's see if that makes a sound. Stand by. Nope, that's not it. That means it's still in a hole, which is a good thing. Stand by. Well, there it is. I don't know if it's a dime or a penny. But it was seven scoops deep, I know that. There was three scoops after I got the marble out. Here's to be a wheat penny. Stand by a second. I'm thinking dime now. I scraped it on the edge. You can see there's some silver shining through the sides of it, not copper. It must be some sort of dime. Stand by for later. I knew that marble was going to bring me some luck. Look at that little heart ring. I don't know if it's gold or silver. It looks like silver in this picture. But with all this iron, it could be discolored. But I'm thinking silver right now. Taquito. Ring man got him a ring again, again, again. Let me see it again. Looks like one of them surfer kind of rings. I see a little. What's it say? Classic. Oh yeah, nada. Probably come out of. Oh no! Don't get in that mode. I don't like that mode. Get out of there fast. Ring the scoop. Ring the scoop. Came in at 1206, but it don't look like 1206. It looks like 1242 or 1245. It's got something right on it. I can't make out what it says, but it says something right there. AM something. She's not no new ticket though. 1206. We'll have to check her out when we get home. Ring man's got something here. Looks like it might have been an old ring or something. God, you don't know how heavy it is. Really heavy. Mmm. Stand by. Guru. Got an old stainless ring. Got some rings around the uh, spot today. Yep. Just not. I've got all kinds of treasures in this pouch here. Nice old pocket knife. God knows that's a nice one. Yeah. yeah I got a thing for pocket knife. I don't know what it is. I like it. Well, I like finding them. Oh, I do too. That one I found it during the winter was really neat. Yeah. I, I put that one in a uh, shadow box. That guy, uh, Thomas, he's found a bunch of damn rings. Every time he goes out, I mean, not rings, but knives. Yeah. And he found some gold rings too, wherever he's hunting at. <laughs> yeah, where that's, he says a secret big, spot. He doesn't tell anybody. <laughs> Got a bird of some kind. Looks like it might be a pendant. See that little thing right there?
Well, we're getting ready for the roundup. Wednesday's roundup. It's Thursday morning. We didn't do it last night. We had to go out. Forecast is rain all day. Rain Friday, rain Saturday, rain Sunday. I got the Thursday night gig today from 4 to 7. That may get rained out. Saturday's night gig is 40% chance of rain. I don't know. Stand by. Okay. Roundup. The bay gave us a lot of tickets yesterday. No, I should say targets. A few tickets. You see, it gave me a record number of 22s. I got 25. I put a screen in my scoop. I don't know if you all noticed that, just to see how many I could catch. Well, I caught 10 the first day. I caught 11 yesterday and 25 today, or yesterday, I should say. Needless to say, I'm taking the screen out. I did find two real bullets, the bullets themselves, an old one and a big fat one, fired one. Two screws, you know, the normal stuff, but a lot of them damn bullets. Look at that. And you know, they, these things are really funny. If they're dark colored like this, the CTX will bring them in at 12.03, 12.04. Now, of course, these are shiny when we find them. The brass ones will come in higher. They come in 12.15, 12.17. It's odd. And these little teeny ones, the shorts, they come in different. You never know. But they sure sound good. I mean, there's lots of them. I got a toasted mercury dime. I don't know if you can see her or not. A 46 Rosie. Two more Indians, uh, 50, hell I can't remember, 52 nickels it looks like. And a nice marble. You don't find many marbles there. I found uh, 925 with ice in it. A little bird pendant, a nice little silver. Hello. This ring is a uh, rang up 1206 in the gold range. I don't know what it is. Bobby says it's a nickel ring made out of nickel. It's got a description on top of it. And some little m marks. I might have it upside down. Let's try it this way. It's got no marks inside of it. I don't know what it is. If it, maybe it is a nickel ring. And the buffaloes, I don't think there's any dates on the buffaloes. Well, maybe. Hold on a minute. The buffalo on the right is a 1938. The other one I can't make the date out on. In the poor old Mercury. She's really toasted. All in all, we had a pretty good spin. We get that little silver ring. Or heart ring. Got two, three little hearts, two on each side of the big one. Okay, that's it. We'll see what the weather brings. Stand by.